Hello friends, this is Vasant Nayak from Vastek channel. Please subscribe to our channel. We will update latest information for you. Thank you. Hello friends, Wel welcome to Vastek channel. Once again today we will see one more program that is according to VTU that is second program that is to short, uh, sort n, n numbers in ascending order or descending order by using bubble sort algorithm. We, all, of, uh, all of us we know bubble sort algorithm, right? So you can see here the initialization steps, uh, sorry the, uh, the algorithm is uh, given here. So let me explain the algorithm like uh, in bubble sort we know uh, when we sort 5 numbers uh, there will be when you sort n numbers there will be n minus 1 uh, comparison and n minus 1 pass will be there. What is that n minus 1 comparison? Like uh, when you sort uh, 5 numbers, uh, first let me write uh, first number is uh, 25, 15, 17, 35 and 16. So first what it will do, it will check this and this. Uh, and uh, it will uh, reorder the number according to ascending 15, 25, 17, 35 and 16. Now in the second uh, comparison it will check this and this 15, 17, 25, 25, then 35, 16. Now this will check this and this. So now you know 15, 17, 25 is lesser than 35, it will be like written like this only and 16. So after that it will check this and this. 15, 17, 25, 16 and 35. So here, how many comparisons? 1, 2, 3, 4. This is the given number. Comparison is done 4 times, right? So means uh, n number is there, n minus 1 uh, comparisons. Like this, uh, uh, there will be n minus 1 passes like this uh, this is first pass uh, n minus 1 pass will be there so that uh, highest number will be bubble just like a bubble uh, it will be moved to the end of the array here yeah. in the ascending order so this is our uh, main algorithm uh, and uh, here step is given you can go through it uh, so let me explain now once again uh, dot model small dot data and uh, in dot data data segment uh, initialization of the data uh, sorry data segment uh, we have taken an array and we have inserted the numbers uh, it is not ordered actually uh, because uh, we are using bubble sort algorithm here the name of the array is given nums and it is of type uh, data word 16 bit array 16 bit word and uh, we will try to find out the length of the element the number of elements uh, by using len uh, len is the name given to the location uh, and I use equate and I will use formula that is dollar, dollar indicate the uh, location of the pointer after inserting these elements. The pointer will be at this stage, uh, that address minus uh, starting address of the base address of the num, uh, nums divided by 2 will give the divided by 2 because it is a uh, data word and each location will store only 8 bits not 16 bits that is why divided by 2 will give number number of element then initialization as I said in the previous video you have to initialize uh, at the rate data means you are moving the data segment address to AX register from AX to data segment register that is called as uh, initialization then uh, LN minus 1 as I said uh, 
length uh, yeah, if there is n numbers n minus 1 pass is there so i want to store uh, n minus 1 pass ln minus 1 pass in the cl similarly ln minus 1 uh, comparison uh, in uh, ch so cl and ch are used for passes and uh, comparison then uh, take the effective address of num and store it in uh, si now the content of the si is moved to ax first element is moved to ax and uh, compare that element with the second element first element with the second element jump on carry no exchange for example if the first element is uh, first element is a uh, 2 second element is 3 what the comparison will do cmp cmp will do 2 minus 3 2 minus 3 definitely will give you carry right so jump on carry no exchange that means the first element is 2 second element is a 3 that is in ascending order first element is low second element is a high that indicates jump on carry no exchange you need not exchange let it be otherwise you exchange how you exchange move the second element to the ax and move ax to the si like this move the second element to ax ax to uh, si move the second element uh, to ax ax to si and you exchange it so exchange will do that task by taking temporary variable after that uh, increment si in a no exchange you see increment si in increment si you know why we have to increment two times si we have to take the second element right in the comparison second element come you have to need to compare the second element now so increment si increment si decrement ch you decrement ch what is there in the ch ch you know number of a comparison jump no zero repeat the comparison similarly similarly here decrement cl also number of passes jump no zero repeat the passes repeat the passes you can see here number of comparisons and uh, number of uh, passes number of comparison number of end three and start and uh, start actually here uh, start is not required uh, so you can uh, you can uh, omit it uh, so start is not required this is the bubble sort program very very simple bubble sort program so we are taking here ch ch is used to store uh, number of comparisons uh, cl is used to store number of passes and we have to only think here this this case jump carry no exchange let me explain if you take first number so suppose first number is 2 second number is 3 compare instruction will do what 2 minus 3 2 minus 3 means it will borrow one uh, one from that side uh, that time uh, carry flag will be enabled so if the carry flag is enabled uh, that indicates uh, first number is smaller than second number no sorting in that ascending order only uh, otherwise you exchange by using exchange command it will exchange after that increment sa two times increment uh, decrement ch uh, decrement cl uh, repeat it important so now if you this is in ascending order for descending order only thing is you have to change this instruction nothing else instead of jc you have to write jnc instead of jc you have to write jnc jump no carry that is descending order no other changes if you want to see the descending order number jump no carry jnc is it clear so this is about a bubble sort program. Thank you.